Forward Keys unveils its recent study on the Middle East market at the Gulf Travel Show. The Middle East is performing slightly better than the world average, with issued tickets 77% behind against 82% behind worldwide. This is better than in the Asia-Pacific and Europe, but not quite as good as in the Americas and Africa. The top five destinations in volumes of tickets are the UAE, Qatar, Saudi Arabia, Egypt and Bahrain. But when looking at the level of reactivation of travel, we can see that Egypt and Qatar top the list. Between January and March this year, international tickets to Egypt represented 41% of their 2019 levels, and in Qatar, they represented 33% of their 2019 level. In January, a travel corridor between the two countries was opened and led to a strong rebound of travel to Egypt, to the point that the volume of issued tickets for a trip to this country in the first half of 2021 is 156% higher than in 2019. That's right. What we're witnessing here is not only recovery, but growth during a crisis. Top destinations for Russian visitors in Egypt are Cairo, Sharm el-Sheikh and Urgadam. Between June 2017 and January 2021, what has come to be known as the Qatar diplomatic crisis has negatively affected air connectivity between Qatar and several countries in the region. With the end of the blockade, Qatar has been able to develop new connections and its regional position. As we can see on this chart, 38% of capacity in Q1 2021 were due to new routes with Saudi Arabia, the UAE and Egypt. This renewed connectivity has helped Doha take over Dubai as the leading hub for transfers in the region. In the first half of 2021, Doha accounts for 32% of transfers and one night stays on the region, against 30% for Dubai. As this chart illustrates, Doha's market share has very significantly improved compared with 2019, while Dubai's has been reduced. Oman Air expands its codeshare cooperation with Qatar Airways. Jabal Omar signs up with Archipelago International for two of its hotel projects near Mecca. Ashman Hotels achieved 75% occupancy in the first quarter in 2021.